Hi, Doc Revis here with Watch Me Work It. Percent concentrations. So let's work some volume, volume, percent problems. Here's a problem. What is the volume, volume, percent of a solution of 5.2 mils of corn syrup having a density of 1.48 gram per mil and 20.5 mils of skim milk having a density of 1.4 gram per mil? In this case, we're doing volume, volume, percent. So let's just set it up as volume, volume, percent will equal the the volume of the material that we're looking for. Okay, in this case, what we're looking for is corn syrup. So we have volume of the syrup divided by the total volume, always times 100 for percentage purposes. So here we would take the 5.2 mils, we would take the 5.2 mils and we divide it by the total volume, which is 5.2 mils, plus the mils of the skim milk, which is 20.5 mils. And that works out pretty good. This example of volume, volume. So everything is already in volume. We punch the numbers through and we get 20 point percent. We put the point in, emphasize that it's two sig figs here. Or you can put 20, the bar over it, and say 20%. So that would be an example of a volume, volume percent for a problem like this. So let's do another problem. What is the volume, volume percent of a solution of 5.2 gram of corn syrup, density 1.48 gram per mil, and 20.5 mils of skim milk, having a density of 1.4 gram per mil? So to do a volume, volume, we set it up as any other percent, this would be the percent of the volume of the syrup over the total volume. And so in this case, we don't know the volume of the corn syrup. So we're gonna convert it and find out what it is over here. And then we're gonna put it in. This will be times 100 here, by the way. So let's go over here and let's do the conversion. We're gonna convert, do the conversion over here. We over here on this side. And so we're gonna convert 5.2 grams to mils. And so we know the volume by the, by the density formula. We know that by the density formula, volume equals mass over density. We can rearrange that formula to get it. Rearrange the original density formula to get it. So this is 5.2 divided by 4.8 grams per mil. That's the density. We run this through our calculator, we get 3.5 mils. We can also do this by dimensional analysis by 5.2 grams times bar grams to mils, and you'll get the exact same answer. You have 1.48 grams for every one mil, and we get 3.5 ml. Therefore, we put this in our formula as mils, 3.5 ml of corn syrup. And we need the ml of corn syrup brought down here plus the mil, and we get these values times 100. And if we punch that through on our calculator, we will get 15%. And that's a 15% volume, volume calculation. 